bitter, unrelenting cold sinks through layers of insulation to chill you to the bone. Wind howls as snow piles up to block roads and freeze doors shut. Darkness descends by late afternoon. This is winter in Canada, testing your will to survive. When temperatures plummet to extremes, everyday tasks become life or death challenges. Just taking out the trash means bundling up like an astronaut. As a newcomer to Canada's fierce winters, I was not prepared. Get ready to find out what enduring months of sub-zero cold is really like. With travel bloggers portraying pretty snowfalls and cozy cabins, Canada's winters seem idyllic. But polar vortexes and blizzards tell a different story for those toughing it out in the Great White North. Beyond tourism fantasies, how do everyday Canadians cope with months of snow, ice and frigid darkness in the country's coldest northern and central regions? In this video, I'll share my brutal awakening after relocating from sunny Australia to Winnipeg, Manitoba, known for the most severe winters. From learning to drive on snow and ice to avoiding frostbite by just taking out the trash, discover the harsh realities of living through weeks straight of sub-zero temperatures. Here's what surviving the coldest, longest winters actually feels like. Fighting impassable snow drifts. After only eight hours, blowing snow can pile into tall barriers, blocking doors and trapping cars. Digging out becomes a daily duty using shovels or snow blowers. Despite constant shoveling, hidden ice leaves walkways slippery. Braving deadly cold snap dangers. When wind chills plunge between minus 20 and minus 40 Celsius, exposed skin risks frostbite in under 10 minutes. Stepping outside means covering every inch of skin, while the simple walk from house to car can be life-threatening. Conserving heat to avoid pipe bursts. In older homes, overnight lows cause pipes to freeze and burst, flooding the house. Thermostats stay around 21 degrees Celsius despite high heating bills. Draft ceiling and insulation provide only partial relief when it's minus 30 degrees for weeks. Stockpiling supplies. Before isolation blizzard frequency means preparing for possible power outages or road closures that lock families inside for days. Emergency kits must include food, medicine, first aid, flashlights, and backup power. Combating constant exhaustion. The long, frigid winters strain mental health for months on end. Lack of light from early sunsets and being stuck indoors create vitamin D deficiency and seasonal affective disorders requiring special sun lamps. Adapting clothing needs for every task. Braving, the cold relies on wearing multiple insulating layers and waterproof outerwear. Yet indoors, the bundled clothes become stifling. The cycle of shedding and redonning winter gear is endless. Overcoming dread of endless slush and ice-frozen sidewalks and mountains of filthy, icy snow linger for six months, making walking precarious. Slush splashes constantly soak winter boots and pants. The grimy mix lingers into April, melting grudgingly, paying heavily for winter-proofing life. From snow tires and emergency kits to higher heating and clothing costs, Canadians spend thousands a year on survival essentials. Yet snow shoveling strains backs, requiring physiotherapy paid out of pocket. Maintaining holiday cheer through endless darkness. Few twinkling holiday lights penetrate the gloom of short, sub-zero days and long nights. Seasonal depression increases from a lack of sunlight and being constantly confined indoors. MDs prescribe happy lights. Adapting vehicle storage and driving parking on roads is prohibited for snow removal. Impossibly icy back lanes and sub-zero temperatures make clearing snow off cars, sheltering in garages essential. Learning to steer, turn and stop gently to avoid skidding challenges driving skills. By March, the frigid darkness causes Canadians to wonder if warmth and light will ever return. While postcards depict sparkling wonderlands, surviving here demands an endless fortitude from citizens toughened against the elements by generations born in the snow. Beyond majestic nature lies menacing danger, hiding under winter's cloak of glittering white. Have you endured bitter cold and endless snow? How do you cope with the winter extremes where you live? Share your strategies and solidarity stories below. And be sure to like this video if you learn some new winter survival tactics. Stay warm out there.